Is your brand struggling to know what's working and not working in your social media strategy? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can perform a competitive analysis to see how your brand stacks up against the competition. Hello and welcome. My name is Eddie Garrison. I help brands just like yours grow their digital presence by utilizing the power of social media with real world strategy, design, and results. I'll show you how to take your brand's digital presence to the next level with actionable tips, strategies, and tactics you can start using today. The old saying of keep your friends close and your enemies closer works in the social media world as well. Checking in on your competition will help you see what's working in your industry as well as keeping tabs on your competitors and what they're doing, which is never a bad thing. I suggest putting together a list of around five brands that are your direct competitors and you're going to be compiling data like what social media networks are they utilizing, what is their follower count, how often do they post content, what time of day do they post content, what days do they post content on, what type of content was successful, are they engaging their audience? And are they responding to their reviews? You'll also want to make note of what type of content they're posting to their social media outlets. Is it all business? Is it humorous? How much is sales driven? And are they engaging with their audience? Now, although page admins are technically the only ones that can see the actual analytics of accounts, you can use a simple formula to help better determine how their engagement rate is performing. So take a look at their last 30 posts and use the following formula. Total number of engagement activities like likes, emotions, comments, shares, and divide that by the total number of fans or followers that page has. So as an example, a page has 400 engagement activities, divided that by their 4,000 followers equals a 5% engagement rate. So anything above a 4% engagement rate is actually a good guideline that their content is engaging their target audience with success. Now that you have a good benchmark of your direct competitors, take an objective look at your own brand's social media practices through the same process you use to evaluate your competition. Record this information just like you would with your competitors and use this as your baseline to compare your brand with your competition. Now that you have all this data compiled, it's time to start putting it to some good use. Take a look at where your brand is missing the mark compared to your competition. Review your notes to see how they're performing better in those specific areas and start to assemble ideas and strategies that you can implement to improve in those specific areas. Next, determine what specific steps your brand will take to improve in those specific areas. Your best bet will be to break these down into monthly and quarterly goals that will be segregated out within your brand's team into specific weekly and daily tasks. When you're complete with your competitive analysis, your brand should be able to answer these questions. What social media marketing improvements does our brand need to make? What goals do we need to set to improve our social media presence? How do we change our overall strategy to reach those goals? What internal changes do we need to make to put those into action? What areas, applications, softwares, and processes are needed to be updated to help us reach those goals? Now, once the first month or quarter of analyzing your changes is up, step back and reassess how these new changes to your social media marketing are actually performing. Utilizing all that data you've compiled from the prior analysis, go back and review your overall goals. Have they been effective? Are there any specific areas you missed completely or that you can improve on even more? Are there any areas that are doing really well now that your brand can actually expand on? Overall, what worked and what is either lacking or totally missed the mark? Compare this new data to your first benchmark assessment of your brand compared to your competitors to see if you're catching up and growing your social media presence.